Hey guys, it's Bailey. It's your last week of Quarantine Corner, and this week we're gonna talk about tide pools. Tide pools are really awesome because they're a great place to check out all summer long. It's probably the best time to go looking for them. So what is a tide pool exactly? A tide pool is a body of water that when the ocean recedes, it's left behind. So it can be left behind in divots in the sand or it can be left behind in rocks and rock surfaces. When you go out to a tide pool, this is a great spot to look for different animals and plants. You guys can find different kinds of crabs, different kinds of snails. You might see some little fish running around in the, or swimming around in the water or a little maybe crawfish walking around the bottom. You're also gonna see different kinds of seaweed and you can identify all these different animals and plants based on the guides down below. Some very common things you'll probably find very quickly. You're gonna find green crabs, which are an invasive species that come over to us from Europe. You'll recognize them, they're gonna be small or about this big fully grown, green, and they'll have five little pricks along the side of the shell up by the eyes. You can always remember that because green has five letters and so they'll have five pricks on each side of their shoulders. The next thing you're gonna easily find are dog whelks and periwinkles. Those are two different kinds of snails. Dog whelks are the ones with the spiral shells that you'll see and periwinkles are completely smoothed out. So when you're looking for those snails as well, try to remember, is it a dog whelk or is it a periwinkle? All right, guys, that's about it for now. So happy hunting out there in the tide pools. Make sure you guys are careful when you're walking on the rocks and seaweed. It's nice and slippery. And don't forget to dig into the seaweed as well. Great places to find crabs. All right, have a good one, guys. Happy hunting.